up sauce gang and welcome back to the channel hot sauce beats here with the reaction i am super stoked about because eric has finally dropped my 600 day transformation against mr beast now mr beast and eric have been in this roughly about a two year long uh losing weight lifting getting in shape competition and at the end of it who's in the best shape and stuff like that. But the reason why I'm so stoked for this is because I've also been on about a two year health journey, health and fitness journey as well. Uh, if you've been watching the channel for a while now, you've noticed my face used to be a lot more round, a lot more bigger. Uh, I've lost about 40 pounds over the last two years. Uh, gotten a lot more shape. You know, people call me Swole Sauce Beats. But uh, anyway, so I'm just, I can relate to this and I'm stoked to see what they've done. But before we peep this out, can you show Eric some love by subscribing to his channel and chat? We're trying to get to a quarter million subs. So if you haven't yet, please smash that subscribe button and join the Sauce Gang family. But enough talking, let's get to reacting and roll that bomb ass intro. Hot Sauce Beats is finally here. Hot Sauce Beats is finally here. Eat, sleep, make beats. Eat, sleep, make beats. Hot Sauce Beats. Woo -hoo! What you, what you guys do, bro? What you guys do? I signed a legally binding contract with Mr. Beast that says that we both have to work out every single day for 600 days. And That's at the end crazy. of it, we have to compete in an actual bodybuilding competition to see who got the best result. You feel so lean. When do yeah, I this get is going to be crazy. Also, that contract it's says that if I miss days. a single day of working out, I have to get Mr. Beast's name tattooed. Oh, that's forehead. right. That's right. Oh, I just don't Mr. want a tattoo. Beast. I don't mind it. Yeah, that would be embarrassing. Okay. I cannot let that happen. Welcome to my very important slideshow. It all started with a phone call. In a year, let's do a bodybuilding contest. Are you giving Jimmy a standing ovation right now? That guy now? helps blind people. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> that guy helps blind people. Yo, he's wild. That man does not understand the value of money. We had our terms, 100 grand on the line. Loser has to had donate 100 grand. Wow. Make sure that I didn't realize that. Guy that. did what any businessman would do. I brought in the lawyers. Free. Hey, what's up? It's me, Saul. Saul, we we'll sign the contract. Sure thing, Rick. I'll get it to you real quick. We had stakes. The contract was signed, and it was time to put in the work. Dude, okay, Jimmy, Jimmy definitely had some weight to him, man. I better look awesome after this. He said he was really not healthy at all. That's definitely the most amount of weight that I can lift. Today is day 10. But to be very honest, I could have never guessed how hard the next 10 days of my life would be. Beefcakes like Brad made me realize two That's things. That's so cool, Number bro. One, he's working out Bradley Martin. It's gonna be very hard. I watch this Bradley's content. I watch oh, a lot indeed. of fitness uh, influencers on YouTube. And number two. So you're telling me you just go to the top set? Yeah, always. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's so funny. Yeah, bro, that's just something you would do. If I wanted to absolutely secure the win against Mr. Beast, I needed a trainer. You're weak. Look at him. Look at the way he's looking at you. Jimmy already had a trainer, so he was one step ahead of me. I needed a trainer, which was convenient because halfway across the world in sunny Greece, a complete stranger saw me on Bradley Martin's podcast. Oh, I love podcast. those core powers, At just dude. a glance, he could tell that I wasn't going to make any real progress without some hands-on help. So he literally flew across the world to Los Angeles to hunt me down. What's going on, man? You're tall, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's up? What's up? What's up? Good to meet you. How do you pronounce your name? Paraskivas. I got my boy Coach P here. <laughs> Picture of me before, and then he's got. Look at me, this, man. This is me after, and then this is what your face is gonna look like here in just a minute. We thought he was gonna kill you. <laughs> Truly. So if you needed to trust Not Dr. Dead. P over here, there's his entire resume. He's just got it out for you. So Coach P created the bullet. Oh, here's my resume, bro. I'm just flexing, dude. Let's go. Come on, dude. I'm, I'm getting there. I'm getting there, bro. Kind of, you know. I don't know. Pounds of muscle to be gained. Me with 20 more pounds of muscle looks like a different person. For sure. He monitored every pounds. bite of food that entered my body. Monitored this every is where I sleep. Then would slack at, dude. Then would me out of bed in the morning to make me work out. I don't eat I as good as I should. He would force me to at 2 a.m. And if there wasn't a gym around, he would make one. This guy wasn't a real human. He was an algorithm that only understood fitness and breathing. He was perfect. Coach P was so intense. Ah! At one point, I literally snuck away and then flew to Texas to escape him. Today's day 74, featuring Ryan Trahan. <laughs> I feel like I've never seen Eric this dialed in. There is no break because Coach P. The rest is done, bro. Let's <laughs> go I tried to hide my travel <laughs> details from you. You just booked the flight and came here. Your muscles are not going to grow, but you're sitting on your freaking ass. I had a lot of work to do. I started hosting sport nights where me and my friends would go play sports and encourage our friend group to exercise. Three, two, one. Sport oh. 
Not Fortnite. For not Fortnite. I was finally in a rhythm. There was no way I was going to lose this competition. And Jimmy knew that, too. Jimmy. Oh, Jimmy. Yeah, yeah, Jimmy, Jimmy don't lose at stuff. <laughs> you said you want to get absolutely obliterated today? Of course. I don't want to be able to walk tomorrow. Moments where I should have been celebrating, I was working out instead. Hitting 10 million subscribers. Let's go, baby. Did I hit 10 million subscribers? Still working out. My pizza party in New York. Still working out. I'm going to eat as much pizza as I want today. No. It's my day. Absolutely. Yes. Every major milestone of the year was pushed aside because I had to work out every single day and on top of all of this I still had to make videos for you guys so at this point I had two choices a find a way to balance working out with every other aspect of my life or B I could sacrifice everything and only work and work out I want to give you some feedback if you're open to it mm -hmm. right now it's good I think you should reconsider it's not allowing you to show up as the best version of yourself I don't think that this project is serving you you guys think I'm gonna listen to my business partner? Yes, that's what every <laughs> interview man would do. Y'all think I'm gonna, you think I'm gonna listen? I, out at the world's I get no pizza tattoo. Party. Pizza party. Yeah. Hey, that's crazy. One minute I'm lifting dough, the next minute I'm lifting iron. <laughs> he and I spent two hours in the gym just absolutely getting shredded. And then something strange happened. I actually we started hurt. to enjoy my time at the gym and none of it would have been possible That's without am, Coach dude. P. It felt like we had a real friendship forming. I respect you because like this is actually hard. This guy's actually committed. He under my actual respect. Yeah, like, I appreciate I, that. Yeah. We got this in the bag. And Jimmy was starting to get nervous. Like it's fucking possible for you to win this in four months. That's what I've been trying to tell this Jimmy had a lot of catching up to do, so as a good friend, I recommended him the best trainer that I knew. They always say if you love something, you have to let it go. To Greenville, North Carolina. What's his price? What? <laughs> it's like I broke up with my girlfriend. You Miss Trainer? She's dating. This is surreal, bro. I don't even feel remotely bad because I'm not even paying. I don't give a f. This is so painful. All right, P, let's go to North Carolina. Come on, let's go. I guess I'm just by myself now. And there I was again, oh, six months later, myself. alone. I tried staying motivated, but grinding this out by myself was starting to take its toll. I feel like I'm not making any progress at all. And I took some pictures today to compare myself to me six months ago. And I look the exact same, bro. I don't know, I don't know what to say. Wow, to put so months, much no effort difference? into something and completely fail. This was the hardest part yet. I felt so lost and I wanted to quit. I can tell you right now, chat, and again, this is just something that from I've learned from my journey. If he's doing this for six months and not seeing any gains, means he's not getting enough protein. A hundred, like that is one of the biggest things you can do that in taking creatine. Um, but dude, protein, it does so much uh, for your immune system, recovery, building muscle. Good rule of thumb, one gram of protein for one pound of weight. I mean, dude, hands down. It's impossible to work out every day if you're getting enough protein and not see gains. Impossible. Even in a month, impossible. That is until I got this message. Enter Alex. Wow. Oh, oh my God. Damn. Ah, ah, damn. Damn. This man is huge. He looks like he ate Coach P. I'm Alex Sears. I'm a personal trainer. And for the last three and a half years, I've been specializing in bodybuilding kind of training. His only job in life is to get me as jacked as possible so that I can beat Mr. Beast. Any words other than you're going to kill him? Ah. Eric is 100% winning this competition. I'm sorry, Jimmy, but uh, he has me. I was just joking. With Alex in my corner and other yes, YouTube me. punks giving me advice, I was back on track. Any advice for me on this uh, fitness journey? My mantra is to be great. See, when you don't feel like doing it, be great. <sighs> I'm getting Let's advice go. from other YouTubers. What's up? On how to get big. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So I thought I would ask you. You wanna hit this? Nah. Well, that's your problem. <laughs> What's up, baby? What's up? What are y'all? Do you think of me being in the sports workout company? Dude, this is Woo, little soft beats. Let's go. Somewhere. He's not here right now. That's what I'm saying. My boy Jimmy just got in the gym. Of course. Slacking, bro. Bro, you gotta get your deep sleep for recovery. How much sleep did you get? Eight hours? Sounds like an excuse. I got eight and a half. <laughs> 30 more minutes of muscle building. <laughs> Jimmy and I even worked out together a few times because they always say, keep your friends close and your enemies closer. The boys are getting jacked. Nobody can stop us. I actually saw a TikTok What did that say? 209? 209 days? The top comment with 40,000 likes said, we can't let these nerds get jacked. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> Too late. I could feel it. I was getting stronger every day with every set, but so was Jimmy. It's hard. 
Yeah, this is so inspirational, bro. <laughs> what day I do you think it is? I just love seeing people, seeing people better themselves, man. <laughs> Pretty good bet. Yesterday was our 250th anniversary. Wow. Yeah. Should dude. we kiss now or? No. Okay. On a Got day it. a thousand, we still won't. <laughs> well, we'll see. No, we won't. Is it harder <laughs> no. or easier than you thought it was going to be? Way harder. Infinitely harder. Bro, you can't get B-roll to death. All right. <laughs> I thought I'd just work out for like an hour and it'd be relatively easy, but it's like very time consuming because we're trying yeah, to get working like, out in Crocs. I love it. Wise and like I love two it. Years in one, basically. Mm -hmm. That's hard. And if everything else in my life isn't perfect, I'm just miserable. My life falls apart. Who do you think is going to win this competition, Eric? I don't think anyone thinks I'm going to win. I start off at 41% body fat. So you're accepting you're going to get a tattoo? No, I never said the loser has to get one. It's if you miss a day of working out, which I think he has, but I'm not going to press him on it. So proof. <laughs> <laughs> So oh, Jimmy, that's so sketchy, bro. To see how far I'd come. How you doing, baby? That's a lot of cameras. <laughs> hey. Oh, there he is. What's up, baby? One year, beard. Some bigger shoulders. I'm trying to look like you, dude. Oh, you look great. You look great. Thank you, bro. I love watching I Bradley's it. content, we man. Better way to measure my Him and uh, I watch Sarah as well. Gym legends and trying to break my personal record. I watch a lot of fitness YouTubers, dude. Jesse James West. What to you would be success in PRing today? It's gotta be above. Nick Bear, All right. Will Tennyson, but we'll see. If it's not 255, I'm going to Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Here we go, here we go. What's he going to get up? What's he going to get up? 180, so that's 225, 255. Oh, I didn't see the little, little or the sideways. Good for him, bro. <laughs> oh, this is a cheat meal. Alex can't stop me from eating this. Uh, dude, no, don't do it. <laughs> oh, so good. One, two, three. Jimmy, you're It's over. I was stronger than I had been in my entire life, but it was time to see if the numbers reflected that scientifically. Oh. Science. Technically, I was getting stronger, Science. but Jimmy and I both agreed that as far as... Wow. Jimmy oh, getting a little swole wow. too, bro. Look at those muscles, bro. Woo, woo. Jimmy and I both agreed that we thought we would be way further in our progress at this point in the competition. And even with the internet hounding us, we mutually decided to push it. What? That's crazy. We wanted our results to be insane, which meant that now I had to squeeze in a workout every single day, even with a very busy schedule I'd planned for the back half of the year. You thought I wasn't going to work out on Christmas? You said to yourself, he's going to take Christmas off at least, right? Not a shot. We were traveling the world. I was working out. Enough of this boring stuff. I want to tell you how we're partnering with SoFi to give away $10,000. <laughs> what is this? I mean, it is true. You can bank borrow and invest with SoFi. How do I get that $10,000? I mean, I'm sure you're going to tell them about that no, by the that end of this bit, right? No, that was it. That was all I did. All right. When I was kicking the Sidemen's soccer balls. Welcome to the fifth Sidemen football match. Let's go. Go. Spain has done everything but score. Once again, they are the champions. I was also working out. <laughs> One more thing. SoFi checking and savings allows you to earn up to 4.6 APY with Such direct a good deposit, ad read, bro. which is 10 times the national average saving rate. <laughs> Technically, he's right that you can earn 10 times the national saving average, which is 4.6% APY on any money you keep in a SoFi account. This is honest my favorite part of the podcast. What is this? Okay. <laughs> when I was in Dubai. Dubai! Yeah. This is luxury, boys. I was working out. Why are you so close to the camera? I'm signing up today, baby. That's amazing. I'd like to get paid. V-Bucks? Get your V-Bucks here? Get your V-Bucks now? I was eating all those pizzas in New York. I will not stop until we break this record. I've got an army with me right now. Three, two, one. I was working out. Oh my gosh. Oh. Crying? What? Why are you leaving you crying? All right, I'm just gonna tell you guys, with SoFi checking and savings, you can get paid up to two days early. You pay no account fees and you can cash in on up to $300 when you sign up for direct deposit. As usual, SoFi and I are teaming up to give away $10,000 to one of you guys. So many previous Arak Mafia winners. Could be you. Click the link in the description or scan the QR code on I'll screen for a chance to win. And make sure to check out SoFi's new podcast, Richard Lives. I did an episode with them. They teach you how to use money. It's pretty cool. Anyway, I was getting stronger. I was hitting my goals and I was doing anything it took to get my name tattooed across that man's forehead. Oh, oh yeah, baby. I mean, it's a good looking tattoo, bro. 
direction. You look sick. I was mentally strong, physically you look strong. Sick. Everything was working. And that brings me to today. The competition. What? We're six weeks out from the competition, and I am about to suffer. Beans is filming, by the way. Why do you get so close to me? This is where we're going to be spending the next six weeks, which Alex guarantees will be the most painful six weeks of my entire life. To measure my pain, I've got the painometer over here. We've got the dumbbells, bench thing, treadmill. It's small, I know. And for the next six weeks, this... This is all I know. I'm gonna give up sleep, work, money. I'll probably have to fire you. Bye bye. I'm gonna have to do everything else I normally bye, have babies. to do, except I'll be spending about three hours in this room every single day to prepare for the bodybuilding competition against Mr. Beast, where I will Let's either go, be ripped out of my mind or embarrassed Beans in front of everyone. You're gonna be eating 2,000 calories internet. or less. I'll see you tomorrow. So I began a six week countdown to the most difficult thing I had ever attempted. But at least I have my friends by my side. Oh, my daily workout uh, schedule for the next six weeks was one hour of cardio, uh, one hour of lifting weights, and one hour of posing. Remember what it feels like? That's exactly what you want to be like. I was balancing one working out with work, my cow. relationship, and still trying to make YouTube videos until I got this yeah. phone call. Jimmy and I ended up talking for a while and we came to the conclusion that it was going to be actually impossible for him to catch up to the natural lead that I had in just six weeks. So I had a decision to make. I could either quit this project and go back to the good life of eating pizza every day, or I could still compete against real bodybuilders in an actual bodybuilding competition. As you guys know, I don't quit easily, so I decided to raise the stakes. Instead of competing against just Jimmy, I'm gonna compete on a real bodybuilding stage in just four weeks. And Alex was ready to torture me. I also me. forgot to tell you that you no longer have so did it, I misunderstood that. Did well, Jimmy still, is he still competing? So we're making YouTube videos for a living, that's a blessing. This week, I'm probably like a 6.5 right now. Something I haven't been doing that I'm supposed to be doing is learning how to pose. So you can have big muscles, but you have to know how to show them off. Can you guys be my stand-in crowd? Yeah, yeah, easy. Okay, this is not gonna go well for me. Smile, eye contact. Walk out right here and see how you can get into it. Let's go, bro. The muscles are coming in. see our left, bro. <laughs> Flexing like a baby. Dang it. Dude. Hello, oh, baby flex. Your training looks like a freaking scared puppy. Please don't hurt me, bud. Please don't hurt me. Do it again. Walk He's gonna end you, bro. He's gonna end you. Yeah. He's so jacked. Oh my god. Should I go for the thumbnail face? Oh god. Yeah. Thumbnail face. Thumbnail face. <laughs> <laughs> Backflip at the end, that is awesome. For real? Don't do it, man. I can't be in front of when you do these things. How am I supposed to practice? I Finally, we were only seven days out from the competition, and it was time to get Let's serious. Go, bro! The lines between work and workout were so blurry at this point. One moment I'm doing side lateral raises, the next moment I'm in a high stakes meeting, both at the exact same time. But it's, it is what it is. I don't feel like way about it. We are five days out from the competition. I'm probably at like an 8.5 on the pain days. scale, and I'm not. Was even it show at three? Isn't right isn't the competition at 600? Fat to lose if you can believe it. This is gonna be your toughest week. Our workouts would be like 30 minutes long, maybe met with posing down your calories in three days. I'm barely here. If I go to this thing yeah. and I place last, I'm gonna be with it. It doesn't matter. It does matter. Yeah, it doesn't matter. I will become a meme on the internet. You <laughs> will not look bad. That's 100% certain. You're underestimating what can be done in this week. Even though I was completely overcome with self-doubt after two trainers, 600 days of training, I'd come so far and there was no way I was gonna back down now. We are 48 hours out from the competition. I've stood in this exact spot okay, for so the six weeks straight. At 602. It might have been the most uncomfortable six weeks of my life. You guys don't understand how badly I want pizza. And then I'm spending the rest of the day on an airplane to North Carolina to go meet up with my good friend slash arch nemesis, Mr. Beast. All right, here Let's we go, go, bro. Jimmy confrontation Okay, so time. Jimmy is doing the competition too. Let's go. Yeah, I didn't know you were coming. We're I, just, very casual. I just T pose. <laughs> How's it going? What's up, dude? <laughs> oh my god, you feel so lean. When do I get to see it? All right, we moved to the posing room. I didn't even know the gym had one. Wow, that is crazy. Pat, what do you think of the physique? I was impressed, man. First time, shredded. Thank crazy. you. Thank you. Let it go. It was only at the cost of everything. <laughs> I don't understand. It's only at the this. cost of my YouTube career. 600 and two days. Working out every single day. When I started, I was fat. This has been a wild journey. I'm just saying, like, were there any 
days where you potentially missed a workout because if you did, yeah, then theoretically you should have my what name is, tattooed uh, somewhere on oh your body. Oh my god! Oh, I, someone forgot to re-rack their weight. Let me go make sure it's re-racked. I was a little skinny fat boy. Basically, both of us did nothing but grind YouTube. Whenever we started together, we thought, oh, we'll both just work out really hard, and then we'll both just compete. Even you, two years later, how did you think you'd be bigger than you it's are now? Almost two I years. I tell Alex dude. all the time, like, I can't believe how little progress I've made in the amount of time. <laughs> Does that piss him off? It may, yeah, yeah, he gets really mad. <laughs> yeah. But I think when we started, it was like, we both thought if we just like went to the gym and worked out really hard, we would just end up in the same spot. It's, it was just it's a mentality, it's, so a, it's a lifestyle. Yeah. Yeah. Eating, actual bodybuilding sleep, competition, I'd working still out. Probably another year. Yeah. You look like a different human being. I do think that we both have like severely I'm, changed our life for did. the better in the last like 602 days. And I'm very grateful for us doing this challenge. There he is. You feel like you'll continue to work out? Oh, of course. I mean, mostly because I just don't want to die young. Just gotta do less uh, seven I... days buried alive videos. Those make it very hard. I'm gonna go <laughs> compete. Do you have any words of wisdom for me? Kill the competition, then you can't lose. All right, watch this, watch this, yep. ready? Go for it. Yo, this sick is transition. Crazy. Oh, so Oh! Oh! Whatever it is, whatever it takes, you only choose once in your oh, life. Dude, I'm pretty, I'm, I'm, I'm stoked to see this trend. Next competitor, transformation. Number 25. Go, Rick! Completely incinerate the competition. Is Eric Decker? Yeah! You've got this. Get up, George! Get up, George! <laughs> I'm so happy for him, him and Mr. Beast again. It's uh, it's a lifestyle change, man. And you know, it's definitely gonna help you live longer, be there for your grandkids and you just, you feel better. And that's the thing at the end of the day, like I was getting so sluggish. I wasn't feeling good. I wasn't sleeping good. I was groggy throughout the day. And I just wanted to feel better. I wanted to look better. And uh, and the other thing on it too, you're gonna mess up. You're gonna fail some days. You're gonna miss the gym. You're gonna maybe even fall off, miss it for a week, two weeks, a month. Um, but what matters is that you get back up and get back in the routine and continue to improve yourself and get better. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Let me know what you think in the comments. Make sure you show Eric some love by subscribing to his channel and chat. We're trying to get to a quarter million subs. So if you haven't yet, please smash that subscribe button and join the Salus Gang family. Enjoy the rest of your weekend, and remember, it's a sleep at McBeats, and as usual, we count on another. That's all I got. Boom, I'm out. Cuckoo! Come below for Salt Skate. Peace out, chat. Bye!